Yes, Surrey Nation. We are excited to get this season off with a bang. I think they're all taking tires. And on top of that, it's going to be even saucier. It's going to be an all-out shootout to the end. He's got a lot of sight on these guys. You gotta do is win the race. You don't have to lead a whole bunch of laps. Oh, they're gonna be side by side going into the next corner. Oh, that's a big contact in the back of the field. Can't stay out there like this. He stayed in it. So we are off and away for SRA. Welcome, SRA. Welcome to our GT3 Main Series Season 10, Division 6, Round 8, our season finale at Silverstone. Tonight, we have Creep Master, yours truly here, and Darren Robichaud. Good evening, folks. Uh, Sean, you got a, a, a notepad and some post its? Keep an eye on me, bud. <laughs> yeah, gotta keep this man in check. <laughs> um, let's talk this about the race tonight. Do you remember, since I'm new here to Division 6 this season, do you know who is, um, is there a tight battle in the championship? It's a tight battle in the championship. Anywhere between P1 and P9, depending on how things mix up, uh, other than maybe some drop points having to, having to play in that. Uh, one, uh, one through P9 could, could go away with a, with a goal tonight. That is quite a tight spread. Um, I'm going to look at the leaderboard really quickly and see what kind of time we're going to expect. We are going to expect sub two minutes left for sure here, I think. I'm seeing uh, Ramon Lorenzo do, had a 159.7 on the leaderboard. Vincent Nicolet has a barely sub two, a 25 millisecond under two minutes, really well. Looks like we are in the qualifying session. Let's go through the track map real quick. So tonight we're at Silverstone, 7.89 kilometers, 3 in 3.6 miles long, 18 turns. This layout is slightly different than our F1 layout. So we start off uh, national straight turn one is Culps. Um quite technical high speed corner. You gotta balance the arrow platform quite delicately. Through Maggot Baggots, pretty famous in Silverstone, and then exit church to hang a straight. That would be a good make or break moment if uh, depends on your opponent how they exit church. That would give you an advantage or disadvantage down stole or hang a straight into stole. And then chicane the veil left right tight maybe side by side switch back and then uh, back to a uh, Hamilton straight which is the F1 straight. Down turn 11 abbeys and now the high speed corner. Um, some car may not need to, need to break most of them just a small dab into farms a flat left-hander turn 12 and then a, uh, into turn 13 village and then left hand tight corner 14 the loop that would bring you to the exit turn 15 in tree that is flat into Wellington straight long breaking also long trail off to turn 16 brooklyn switch back into turn 17 love field and would cut last turn back into our national pit straight that is a lap of silverstone let's check out how our drivers in a quality session that was a fast lap cube that was a lot of mouth movement for sure you, you did that lap in under a minute easy i'm the fastest man 
<laughs> On board with Acom right now is uh, he'll be looking to set his first banker. Let's see who's leading the pack. Is it Acom? I don't think it is Acom who's leading the pack. That'll be car 229. Eisner. There we go. That's the button I want to press. Alright, I'm gonna be back real quick. I may have to relaunch the game. Worries. Yes, I'm gonna relaunch the game. Learn from last week. There we go. Got right in back in the server. First Wednesday night, not my good night apparently for streaming. Suffering some technical difficulties. Yep, yep. You're going to, uh, you're back in, Cube, to reshare your stream. I should be back. Let me, uh, reconnect this and that. There we go. Hopefully we're back in business. Alrighty, alrighty. And I'll get you your feedback. Oh, you, I see. I see what is going on. Give me one second there. Oh, buddy. Quite all right. It is Discord not liking me. There we go. Always is Discord. All right. Looks like our silver. What? Our silver driver, quote unquote silver. Yeah, sure, man. I got a two minutes 0.2 already. Being like. Lap one, lap two, maybe. That's a banker. That's pretty quick for D6 silver banker. Indeed, it is. I wonder how last night D5 had some banger laps that deep, really deep into a D4 standing, actually. So I wonder how a D6 is gonna do. Was it Panzo said? That's what we do in D5. Oof. We they are sweating too hard. They do sweat too hard. So, um, I just look at the leaderboard. Mike Heisner, PB on the leaderboard, is 310 slower than his quality lap right here. So, right now, that man's already putting up PB. Nice. I smell sand in his car. You think? Maybe not little. <laughs> so tonight we have a turnout of 27 cars, being uh, 10 silver, 15 gold. Mark DC is not out in qualifying. Uh, I'm gonna double check. Maybe he got a spanking from the steward. That is correct. He got a D Mark DC got a quality ban for tonight. So it'll be starting from the back of the pack. That is a tough place to start from. Yeah, you are right in the meat grinder. Whoa. So I just said 
Mike Heisner is three tenths up his PB. Right now, he is four tenths up his PB again. Got a heater going. He is uh, expecting. What's the gap? He expecting a just. Oh, he just lost a teeny bit. So two minute flat, maybe. Yes, a full sector and a half to go. Coming to Abbey and to farm. He's carrying some momentum through there. Village, early apex. Into the loop. Send it on the home stretch. Now in sector three. He lost the two tenths advantage he had earlier. Hey, thanks, Yaren. I s never remember th those names. Who Yaren? But J Yaren, thank you. The penetration lord. <laughs> uh, into yeah. wood so, cult. Uh, did he better his time? Not quite. Quite. No, so it was described last night an easy way to remember the Yarens. Jeremy Yaren is J Yaren. And Jason Yaren is J. Yara. J. 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 Yaren. That's right. That's right, Darren. <laughs> I'm on board with Pellerin just across the line. Put him in second row with uh, 201.77. Oh, Morath and uh, Claymore are in the pit. What's up with these two, driver? Do you respect... Uh, Morath got three laps in, and uh, Claymore got two laps. May have gotten off track, maybe, not thinking they could get out in time to put down another lap. And then Andrew got three laps in. Uh, are they? Do they think that's the best they could do? No. Oh. Back into Palerin, he is almost three tenths up into Stoll. Look planned it. Coming into Vale. Are breaking at the curb. Down shift and then a short shift up between the chicane. He's smooth through there, cute. Looks good. Being able to carry the speed through this right hander is key on this track. It is. Keep it, keep it clean. A little he keeps bit clean. lift. Lost his delta here though. Walk down a teeny bit, exiting the loop. I'm gonna go backward to uh, Brian Acom. Acom is eight tenths up into Hamilton Straight into Abbey. Could, uh, could slide him right into P6. Ian or oh, Edward Ryan got the yellow parked. In Aintree, what happened to him? Did the man run out of fuel? Uh-oh. He is still there. He's not in the pit just yet. So I wonder what is going on. Looks like his car started to pull away there, so I don't think it was fuel. He's still... There you go. He just went to pit. Acom currently uh, seven tenths up into Brooklyn and Luffyu. So Acom is the only one that can threaten this pole position. I don't think he's quite got the speed. His gap is too far from behind. That would not. His two tenths improvement wouldn't even bring him a position just yet. Stays in P9. Yo, one, yo, two, sir. Three, got, there you go. You gotta. You gotta park it, man. Duong Bonglio. Did Duong he Bonglio. Oh, P4? he did. He went up with a good catch. A gold driver putting down, putting down a stint. In a silver, oh, three laps, so not a lot of lap. I wonder what happened. What kind of mix up was that? 
Brain fart. Uh, let's we'll see if he goes out. <laughs> I hope not. If he doesn't go <laughs> out, uh, he has a chance of not getting spanked. I think uh, it can be lenient. Uh, yeah. Some steward. Oops. If he doesn't take advantage of things. Yeah. Oops, my bad, right? Yep, yep. Uh, he mourn. Right now, is leading the pack of a uh, silver or uh, gold driver, my bad. Very slowly, probably checking his cars. Make sure you have the right TC, ABS, and BB. Baby or tire, up. but warm them up. Warming up those tires, getting that engine temperature up. It looks like it's a good gap though. He's not pushing, he maybe he won an even bigger gap. So the next bigger gap would be uh, Alan Lung coming down hangar straight into Stoll. That would be actually the biggest gap in front of him around the truck. Hey chat, how's audio? Um, um, tell me about the audio, uh, how audio bounds with uh, Darren. Are we both sounding good? Oh, you sound good. I don't know about me. You look good on uh, OBS. I think the level we are very, very correct. I hope so. <laughs> Rega Tony said, maybe using up um, the gold driver who went out earlier. Maybe trying to use to get some advantage to use up the last ten penalty point for the. Uh, last race of the season. <laughs> While that's true, penalty point technically carries throughout a season into the next. So you don't get to just skip town <laughs> after that. If you do, I guess you, that's what you can do. You don't race next season. Yeah, so, uh, Panzo, does the drop race take the penalties with it? Oh, we wish. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Andrew Learn coming into the start finish line. Let's see what we got here. I'm gonna cross P3. That would be a bank a lot very slow. Uh, it's on purpose, I would say. Just babying the tire. Uh yep. 201 and a half. 2015. We got Nicolay and Johnson putting down some times. Still not to touch Heisner yet. Yep, Nicolay just put down a 20.7. Oh, Lindo, it's a two zero dot four. Up there in a touch, will do. Uh, stoppa. Put down a two zero six eight seven. Gaps closing down to Heisner for sure. But the gap between a P12 and a silver is quite large, I would have to say. I look at no. uh, Nicolette again, Vincent Nicolette. He is 0.523 behind leader. Looking at his current delta, he will be beat pole by a 2.5 tenths. Coming into third sector, passing village and the loop. Let's hop on loose, board. A little loose through there. Into Aintree and Wellington Strait. That is a massive gain. He is still up on his delta. That is looking to beat the hole by three tenths. That would be a sub two. Need Bro Brooklyn, tidy Lafield, house exit, miss second apex a little bit, lost traction on acceleration, lost about a tenth. That was still maybe a sub two. Are we? Do we get a sub two? Not quite. Barely not. Half a ten away from sub two. Yes, yeah, six one hundredths. Yep. Oh, I think that's invalid. Uh, you are correct on that. Um, I'm a hop. Reward to a uh, Aston Martin Lawrence slash Pet's teammate. Is it Pet? No, no. Damn it! I forgot. Lawrence. 
Yeah, Lawrence. I used uh, uh, the nickname name is Pat's teammate. Is it Pat's teammate? Patch teammate. That's right, Patch's teammate. <laughs> It was a good couple of seasons uh, back. Aston, Aston Martin Lawrence and Rob Warren are our team on the genetically themed racing team, o, OBGA. Yeah. Oh, just when he first started, I never remember his name, but he's Patch's teammate. So I keep calling him Patch's teammate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I cursed the man with voodoo. Now he's two tenths down. I'm sorry, sir. Uh, Pizzuto is a full second up. Um, that would bring him a good bunch actually bring him to p13 if he gets to keep this Actually, he would have more P10 potentially not quite p12 or 11 P12, p12. very well very well nice. um, We'll look go to Lindo Seven tenths up into village He's gonna smash pull by half a second and up. He's still up more than half a second. He's gonna smash it. Heisner still holding uh, pretty strong against these gold drivers. Oh, indeed. Coming to Brooklyn. A little wide for Love You. Looks a good acceleration. There'll We're be a four tenths out. advantage on pole. Three tenths. This is our first sub two minutes. Yep. For the 59.752. That's quick. Have we got anybody on track threatening that right now, Q? Not at the moment. We have Nicolet approaching, but not a threat just yet. Nicolet is positive in his delta. I just cursed the man. I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I click on him. He lost all, uh, all the delta he had. So if you click them, it gets them. If I say their names, it gets them. So yep. if you don't click and I don't say, everyone's safe. We have a, oh my god, Lindo, our current provisional pole. It's a quarter second up. 59.5. Another driver, oh, look at this Lorenzo at a current P8. He is the leader of the leaderboard. Um, he's, oh, I said oh. his name, so that's what exactly what happened when I say the man's name. All right, let's give me Lindo some 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 attention. Yeah. Then I guess <laughs> the sorry, man currently Ramon. is four tens up. Yeah, sorry, Ramon. Yep. <laughs> yep. Uh, Lindo currently is nearly half a second up down hang a str uh, Wellington straight. Half a second. Half a second, correct, and some, and increasing. Looking to put down a fifty-nine-one, fifty-nine-two. Yeah. In yeah. Uh huh. We see a 58 in D6, so I'm going uh, home. Brooklyn. Looks really neat. That was clean. 59.4, still really quick. I'm hot one ball to a Leatherwood. Leatherwood right now is a quarter second up and gaining. Past the loop into Village. That could put him P7. No, P6, uh, P8. Nah. Now it's four tenths up, four tenths up. That'll put him to P7. Heisner still, uh, with still a, in the second row. Quality. Podium quality. Silver driver. That's impressive. Yep. Nice on you, Heisner. Nice on you, buddy. Very neat through Luffield. Nearly half a second up, four tenths up now. Leatherwood, that will get him a good couple of position to P7, maybe? P8, just shy. 30 milliseconds. Mancini, our last driver, crossing the line after Lovefield and Woodcock. Has he got gains? He gains. 
Apple tens plus that bring him to P16. Up four positions to P16. Nice little yep. jump. Not bad. Both uh, both uh, top two silver driver Heisner, third third place in second row. And uh, Edward Ryan P12 sixth row. So they are up there. Um, let's name the first 10 starting order real quick we got lindo p1 nicolet p2 p3 we got high center and uh lung is p4 Imon is p5 stoppa is p6 p7 is casey rich p8 we got rip leatherwood p9 lorenzo p10 wrapping up we got johnston all right that's a good one um Darren, you want to thank our sponsor when we're waiting for the drivers to get their setup? Might as well uh, let, let the cars settle and uh, the teams figure out what's going on and we'll, uh, we'll do this right up. So I want to shout out a huge thank you to our SRA sponsors and title sponsors for supporting us here at SRA, as well as support from Documize, a modern business solution for product management. Go to Documize.com to learn more today. And support from Retro Saga, a North American-based gaming company that provides accessories for your favorite classic systems, including Nintendo, Sega, PlayStation, and much more. Enhance your retro gaming experience today at RetroSega.ca. And a big thanks to our affiliates, Track Racer. Experience redefined gaming with Track Racer's high-quality sim rigs and accessories. Use code capital S R A lower case T E at checkout to support us. Armamentario, a toolbox for ACC that will enhance your chance to win. Enjoy a fully customizable and enhanced HUD to change the way you experience ACC. And don't forget, Go Setups, premium eSports setups for everyone. Use our affiliate link in our Discord and take your drive to the next level. This is the standing after seven races for Division Six. We got Casey, Casey Rich, Casey yep. Rich, yeah, Sandro Mancini, Vincent Nicolette, Sergio Lindo, Rob Warren, Roger Dismukes, Austin Martin Lawrence, Dry Bones Malone, and Scott Johnson, all in a tight battle. Oh, they're all quite up. tight. Yeah, and Alan Lung for number ten. Uh, one through five in gold division, we got Rich, Mancini, Nicolet, Lindo, and Warren all battling very, very closely for division wins. And we got Heisner, Rimsk, or Rimsk, Ryan, DC, and Carlin for the top five in silver. And these guys are all with, within hitting distance uh, with, with, with big points tonight to uh, upset these divisions. Uh, there's really no telling what could happen tonight, Cube. Let's go through the team standing. How uh, we got um, Jan. What is yeah, even a team name? Generically themed racing team, <laughs> OBDA. With question mark. That's nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they're they're leading out down with 767 with uh, 36 on their drop points. Uh, TC8 racing team SL. 64 points in their drop point bag, uh, 719, so uh, they, they could upset tonight. Uh, ZDR boys, so the Black Flag Racing, uh, with Roger Nismukes and, and Mike Heisner, 711 points. Uh, they're within they're within range. Uh, they are. Mac the, the Macarena, GRR, they're within range. Uh, it's anywhere from from P1 to P5 to the, the lost drivers, lost drivers are Ixalan. Am I saying that right? Uh, Casey Rich and Dan Meyer, 619 points. Uh, they could be podium for team tonight. We we just you just don't know. Uh, I think the, the fight. Apex, plan E sliders could get it too. I think the fight between uh, the team win, even it is 48 points delta. Is still up for grab because Sergio Lindo and uh, Alan Leung is probably quite high up. Sergio's pole, Alan Leung's in second row, so it will still be a good scoring uh, position. 
and for our current team leader is uh, Aston Martin Lawrence and Rob Ron. They didn't qualify as well. Aston Martin Lawrence quality at P18. And Warren, where did Warren go? I thought he was here. Did he not? P is uh, P22. P22. Oh no, that's what he. That's where he was at. Uh, he's at 24. P24. No, he's not on my. He's not on my yeah, screen. Yeah, he, 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 did, he didn't. Uh, on screen doesn't show that far down. So that may be a big enough starting delta to upset the team championship here. So see who want to drink beer out of a shoe. You gotta fight hard for that. Indeed, you do. That's it. That, uh, these guys have safe and consistent uh, races. Stay anywhere near the positions they're in tonight. There's, there's, there's uh, certainly some upsets tonight. How has a uh, D6 lap one two been? Have they been polite to each other? Well, Q, were you deemed at one point in these races that uh, D5 was the pinnacle of racing? Uh huh. Uh, I've deemed uh, D6 to be the pinnacle of gentlemen. Oh. Uh, really? These, these guys start races like they actually care about the cars around them. Uh, they're very polite, very gentlemanly. It's uh, it's quite impressive. That's excellent. I um, hope I did not curse the start of this race, but uh, everyone so far, Cube, has been phenomenal. That's good. That's great to hear. As our pack slash leader is coming into Love Field, the second to last corner, practically last corner of our Silverstone layout here. P1 Lindo got a massive head start in the final starting guide. You gotta back off a little bit, or is the game actually? I think the game is just lead? wrecked on on the starting guide. I I don't I myself don't like it that much. It's hard. It's confusing. A little hard to follow. Sometimes downright unfair if you uh, didn't follow well in the beginning of the starting final guide. And we're about to lights out, and away we go. Yeah, he's a full car length and then some ahead. Now there we go. A lot tighter. Oh, tight and yeah. green light we go. Oh, Nicola got, got a jump. good launch on the outside. But oh, Lingo got an inside out. definitely get the better turn. Yeah, it looks like he stayed on the throttle a little harder on the inside the of the car. The rear was still doing well. There's some jockeying for position in the back. N no one. No yellows yet. No, no yellows. yellow. Door bang. Oh, we're a little door bang. We are all good. Everyone survived. Just a teeny bit of pain exchange. Down through maggots and baggots, and I'm still seeing no yellow. Congrats, D6. Very well. Back Wicked up start. top. Oof. Uh, looks like uh, Nicolette got overtaken. Is that true? No, no, he's still P2. And then Lindo is still P1. There's no position change. There is a position change for Alan Lung. Alan Lung now P3 overtaking a stopper. Gain a position. There's one position change right there. Yeah, and it looks like uh, Heisner lost a few positions off of that start. He's down into P7 now. Still P1 silver. Oh, where did he start? I gotta take a look. I want, see. I, I want to say he was P3, Q. Heisner. Did he keep the P3 quality? I can't remember. Where did Heisner go? Uh oh. Uh oh. Claymore got disconnected. I see on the spreadsheet. Oh no. No claim was here, so he rejoined. Re rejoined. There's a the bunch of track. small contacts. I don't see Heisner oh. on the. We got some yellow at the back of the pack. Uh. I hope everyone's okay. Six, seven, seven, oh, three. Stopper about. Lost 20%. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh oh. See if I can replay that again. It's a teeny bit hard to catch sometime in this incident. Who we got there? That is a stopper. Alex Stopper. There we go. Oh, he got a little loose there coming Definitely in. Definitely a little loose. Into maggots. Oh, that was farm and village. Into the loop. He got penetrated. That looks like a penetration coming. And we oh, got penetrated. Oh, oh. Yeah. oh double. And triple. that's a oh, oh there's triple. a lot of pentuple. There's a pile. <laughs> there's a pile. That's a pentuple. Oh. Yep. And then more door banging. Oh. 
as hard like when you're in the middle that's you're in the middle that's nothing you can do anymore jesus take the wheel and brian yep. acomb ate it and uh oh lost in in the first part of maggots okay okay no berry r no no damage that's not an expensive uh not an expensive you just mistake. lost time that's good you don't oh no oh no that looks oh he got oh. it he got it, he got it boy <laughs> man dude don't sweat me like that d6 <laughs> that was bad yeah so probably the spin go. hit up his uh tire service a massive amount so the rear is yep. just gone so you got a baby that tire oh i would like to mention that tonight's pit regulation is mandatory tire change no refueling allowed it so you got to bring all the fuel you need on board you have to change tires so textbook strat is you you pit around 30 minutes mark maybe a teeny bit after um that is about the half c rule for tire change if you're up front we probably expect a longer run if in the back undercut is a very real possibility and now so i see another yellow in the back three eight four see if i can find that car that would be more ref replay 30 seconds okay okay good on village come into the loop got squeezed a oh. little too tight i don't oh. know if anyone's at fault there is that heisner or teammate um that's not his teammate the the inside driver i i couldn't tell who's the inside driver the victims morath it was the porsche that got him yes correct with the same livery as heisner i just not, i don't remember the name of the teammate maybe uh nope that is not heisner also i don't have a d6 uh, uh, livery sync because i don't usually uh, host this R R roger disnukes uh where is he uh p25 25. he's currently in the pits yes so after that incident maybe he's looked at i'm gonna go in and fix uh, I don't know if he'll take his tires now. Most 55. likely, you're going to have to. Double dip is never a good choice, so. 55 minutes uh, on Silverstone and a Porsche with, with one set of tires is, is going to be uh, it's going to be dicey. It's going to be a dicey finish. Yep, yeah, you'll be lucky if you have any rubber left by the end of the race. When here we're looking Austin chasing a Pazuto in the back of a Rob Warren. Ron went on the inside of village, outside of the loop. Alex should be able to keep it. Is there a switchback? There's no switchback for Austin from Warren. Oh, he's Good still exit. looking out. Tight battle. Oh. Warren looking the inside for Brooklyn. Back out. He backs out. The nose was in there. Oh. Oh. And I totally looked away. I'm clean. a. He gets clean. Yep. Wait for it. Uh, tip it off. Wait. Wait. Wait, Austin. Nope. I'm going to replay that real quick. I looked away. Oh, yeah. That's a clear penetration. Yeah. Tip it on. I don't know who the other driver was. Other Ferrari. Uh, That is uh, Alex. No, that's right. I don't know who is. That's right. Thibodeau, and I don't know who is the other one. Um, uh, that's pretty Pizzuto? straight penetration. Pizzuto? Yes, you're right. You're correct on that one. Um, um, oh, no. Licklet. I click onto the man, and he's not pointing the right way. Wow, I'm so, so powerful. Let's replay that. Down, hang on straight, <laughs> I believe. I didn't say it. <laughs> Ooh, oh, 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 so he avoid the penetration yeah, and stuff. Good penetration. on him, good on him. Yeah, no, that was safe driving. Yeah. Uh, it, lo it loses some time and at a couple positions, but uh, no. With his pace, died. though, I believe he can get it back not too difficult. Yeah, as long as that didn't rattle him. And uh, some of the races I've seen him so far, he uh, he stays good under pressure. Though He's, the uh, worst part, I would driver. imagine, is him burning up his rear on that spin. That may be the worst consequence. Well, Looks like we might have uh, some tight battles here for uh, P14. P14. A Palerin. J. 
chasing and Ju Do Bong Leo? How do you say that? Uh, I've been saying Duong Bong Leo. I have no Duong idea Bong if it's Leo? correct. Or Duong Let's go Bong with Bong Leo. I don't know if I'm insulting the man or not. I apologize if I am. Uh, Maybe his entire to... family tree is cursing at you right now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the screaming tree. Uh, yeah. so if, if somebody could uh, do that phonetically in the chat, uh, Duong Bong Leo, it, it would probably appreciate not having his name bastardized as many times as we do. Uh, on to uh, Edward Ryan chasing Vincent Nicolet. Vincent Nicolet just uh, previously had a spun on stall trying to not penetrate which it was successfully avoided now he got a burning rear i believe yeah he's been quick in this nissan currently our board, silver winner a leader of the race uh, but still yeah. is looking a mega drive into hangar straight has he got him not in not full for lap nope, i believe he, he, he backs out playing yep. it safe Bide his time. Maybe wait for a mistake. Vincent Nicolette is still a little wide down into Vale. Maybe still struggling with the tear. I'm hop upward to Cliff versus Alan Leung into Abbey's and Farm. He's pressuring. Porsche's breaking is just phenomenal. Uh, I've been practicing that. We're racing it for the uh, endurance, endurance on the weekend. And, Same. Uh, you you can you can break literally two car lengths later in the Porsche and still make entry apex. It's incredible. If I have a peek down inside, thought about it, thought twice. Closing speed is so great under braking for the Porsche. And Lung got an inside, stay defensive, back him up. Hop back to uh, Dubonglio. Chasing Rob Ron. Oh, penetration oh, no. from Pellerin. Not good. Uh oh. Oh, safe Ooh. entry, guys. Safe free entry. Yep. Yep, yep. We safe rejoin, safe rejoin. You got, they got it. And they're got, back on. Oh, look at this oh, gaggle. Sure Good fight. Track. We got Eisner chasing Mark DC. Morath just a little bit behind. Eisner's got an insight into a, a corpse T1. Looks like Mark DC didn't fight. Just let him have it. Didn't want to waste time. Heisner did All have right. quite a pace in the quality though, so maybe uh, Mark DC know that and uh, knows that and didn't want to waste time. And he's had found himself back into P20. He must have been an incident. I do not see he did. any damage. I think he may have fixed it. Let me check. That's but an it, excellent I, he, question. He hasn't. Um, uh, he hasn't pit. Maybe he didn't take correct. tires. He hasn't pit. You're right. He hasn't pit. So in that is right. There's not a whole lot of damage. Not visible anyway. Yeah, that's goodness. Oh, you can see. Yes, yes. The driver's side skirt is a little scuffed up. Oh, is it? Okay. Yes. Um, but it looks like it doesn't cause him aero balance. So, um, he may. What is his gap? He has two seconds to in front. There may. Actually, that's not a bad choice for him if he want to go long. If they have the. Skill to baby is tired. Going long here. This oh. is not a bad time to pit. Oh. oh. Yeah. Mark uh, DC, I'm oh. replaying. Oh my god. So I'm on Mark DC. In front is Claymore, I believe. Oh, oh that's unsafe just... rejoin, my dude. Oh. Just right him. Oh no. Yep. Rest he in had, pieces. He was just a passenger. He, yeah. What did you say? Jesus at the wheel? Jesus take the wheel, yep. Uh, up front, P3 and P2. 
Alan uh, Lowe and Cliff, hang us straight. Chat, chat I'm not sure if that uh, statement counts as a tick in the square jar or not, but let me know. I don't think so. That sounds... That, that I feel like you're still safe so far. <laughs> I'm allowed to say Jesus? <laughs> oh, that's close. That was. Yeah, brown flag. Brown that, flag, indeed. That is a bitch in livery. That may cost you five five pennies. No, that's a that's a that's a gimme. <laughs> yeah, I'll uh, take my I'll take my mulligan on that one. Um, we are at uh, Johnston chasing uh, Edward Ryan. Or is Pony versus Godzilla. Uh, looks like we might have a chase on the Oh, we, uh, Ryan, Edward Ryan went wide. I'm going to replay that real quick. At farm, I believe. And village. Oh, he forgot village exists. And a free place for Johnston. Sorry, I cut you off. What were you saying? Uh, we looked like we had a good battle back there with uh, Gilchrist chasing uh, Martin Lawrence for P10. P10. The 40k livery. Oh, excellent cut by Warren. Oh, asked Martin Lawrence, sorry. It's a little loose. And uh, Gilchrist follows him, follows him out. Last Looks time like they have a pass here. I'm gonna oh. see if I can replay that. Uh, Thibodeau will get off track. That's right. Gotta yep. slide off free place. Ooh, oh, oh my goodness. That's hard to tell. I don't think that is necessarily an unsafe rejoin. He's not exactly on the track. No, I think the, the I think the Ferrari behind him of uh, Yeah, I, I think so. Pizzuto lost it as well. Yeah. We're back onto a Gilchrist chasing Lawrence. I said his name last week and he died, so we've... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Trying to keep it quiet here in the DL. We've made, we've made it past the curse and uh, we got some good racing. That's uh, that's good. Key. Back up front again. Cleef and Allen. Into Abbey. And farm. Farm a little wide. Breaking into village. And even behind oh them, my uh, goodness, that breaking delta. That's tight. Alan Long, extreme defense on the inside, just backing him up. Back him up, yep. Yeah, and right behind that group, you got a good battle for P4 too. Indeed, that's uh, Casey Rich and uh, Nicolet coming up. I'm still following and a closer gap here. Yeah, Ooh. You, you got them all in one shot there now. Yep, Cliff Eye down the inside for Brooklyn, a teeny bit. Thought twice. Delivery reminds me of Thing. Thing? What Thing? Uh, the cartoon, the, movie? the Thing. Oh, I'm not familiar with that one. Now they oh, not quite overlap. Into Abby. He's close. Correction, that was Culp's. Into Maggots and Baggots. And Baggett's very close. Looks like Alan got a bad apex. Who gets the best exit? Alan may have a better one in my in my head. Duck back down in for the toe. Stop uh, just overtook Warren. I see if I can catch that in the replay. Oh, it was a oh, straight so class. Wide. Yep. Side by side through Abbey's. And it's stole, not uh, not stole. It's corpse. Corpse. Gil Chris, Same oh my God! Gil Chris and Lawrence oh. down to stole yeah. side by side. Good overtake. Walls of steels. Wait, am I allowed to say boss? Boss, it's cool, right? I think. Lawrence, oh no! Replay. Gilchrist and Lawrence, I believe this is.
into Vale. Oof. Back up front. With Cliff and Alan Low. Into Corpse. Almost self delete by Cliff. Back. We got uh, Soupy Rice leading Stopper, leading Warren. Fighting the dirty air is hard in these high speed corners. Your yeah, maggots, baggots complex. Nice use of ex, ex, uh, apex. Good church. Stop as a way better exit, but may get backed up by Supi Rice. Can you hear me now? Yes, you're back. Go inside and outside, and then inside again. I missed some action by the looks of it. Yep, I'm glad you're back. I don't know what happened, sir, but uh, I think we're back now. I have some technical difficulties. Yeah, it's Discord's fault. It's always it's their fault. It's usually for me push. I, w I didn't press any buttons, I promise. It's always Discord's fault. Well, the Merc is pushing. That's why it's it never good. There's never a good Electron app. Warren is right off the back of Stopper. Uh, Stopper's putting down some smoke and defense. He did. So Here did a Supi Rice. Supi Rice up front was dodging left and right from uh, Stopper's attack. Being able to anticipate what the driver. Oh! Ooh, he got side by side. Not quite enough, I believe. Oh. Not quite. Yep. Looking he for good toll. Yeah, make him nervous. He'll be, in the, he'll be watching the mirrors now. Fill up his mirror. Yeah, Lindo absolutely checked out. He got eight second lead, so he'll see filled you next up. season elsewhere. Oh, yeah, and Stopper went wide. Filled up his mirror and his shorts. <laughs> and his shorts, yeah. <laughs> With what, though? Yeah. Soupy rice. <laughs> oh my god, that sounds terrible. <laughs> Soupy rice. God. <laughs> Sorry, Q. I hope you're not doing the visuals too. Oh my god, I don't need to. I can feel it already. <laughs> Soupy rice in the pants. <laughs> oh, and that was more fun than people. Oh, oof, oof, that was sketchy, that was yeah. Yeah, he got some curve on that too. He's like, I'm going to show you in all the wrong places. Maybe he got some soupy rice down his own pants. <laughs> Probably does at that point, I bet. I'm gonna hop forward to uh, P2 through P5 <laughs> here. Um, we got Excuse P2, me. Black McLaren. I don't have delivery. I'll learn and they have Cliff He Mion. And then uh, Casey Rich. In the back of the screen, we have Vincent Nicolet. Uh, Nicolet put the pressure on Rich. Nicolet also had uh, had the last fastest lap and the overall purple at a two zero dot seven five. Two zero dot seven five. Yep. That's uh, that's pretty good race pace. D six. Yeah, it looks like I will fit right in here from the look that I'm trying from my attempts in Silverstone endurance. These two, Alan Lung and Cliff, has been a going bumpered bumpered for, for since the beginning of the race. Waiting for an opportunity. Yeah, that's you no. Know the, you, you know the Porsche is staying with him in every turn, and you know the McLaren is just going. See you later when they come out anywhere. There's a straight. And the McLaren hasn't failed there. to make much any mistake so far, so. 
Um, championship point is pretty locked down for both silver and uh, gold at the moment. Um, technically, it's possible, but it's pretty locked down. What's happening right now is a team championship. Uh, Lindo and Nicolette, I believe. Let me double check. Lindo and Lung are a team. Lindo and Lung, that's right. Thank you. Lindo and Lung's a team in P2. 48 points behind Aston Martin Lawrence and Rob Ron in, in the team P1. So right now, it's a possible that we have a team champion uh, lead change. I think TC8 racing team can go ahead tonight. It's Sergio Lindo and Alan Lung. Yeah, so they're P1 looking, too. Looking really, really good. Uh, Lawrence and Warren, where are they position wise? Uh, uh, Lawrence is in P10. And Warren in P13. Yep. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I think you're right. This uh, That could be an upset big time tonight in uh, Team Championship. I have not uh, account for the drop race yet, but uh, look look at um, Lawrence and uh, Warren's position right now. P10 and 13 looks not too bad compared to what they could have been throughout the season. Not that I know how they have been throughout the season, but they not look not too bad. So I don't know how else their drop race is going to be accounted for. Oh, there's a Power World livery. I didn't know that. That's kind of cute. What's Power World? Power World's like a open world, almost Pokemon like game. You catch and you cha train POW slash Pokemon knockoff. It's kind of fun. Okay. I play it quite a bit when it came out. Leung has been leading the train for well, yeah, the last I 25 minutes. When I was young, I played cops and robbers. In real life? <laughs> <laughs> Good no wonder we drive that, so fast. That is a tight train right there. That's some that good racing is. right there. Lungs wide on stoke. Cut back. Lost a teeny bit of time, but uh, no position change. Still the train conductor. Vail? There's a penetration by Johnston, I believe. Oh, Replay no. real quick. I think Johnston penetrated. Actually, I do not oh, know. Maybe a Nicolette. Is that Nicolet? I think it's Nicolet. And he came back from where? What position did he get him from? Oh, oh. no. He okay, he so survived mostly. Yeah, yeah, he hopped the curb and hit him. Uh, Nicolet. Oh, let's see. He uh. He made it back up to P5. Yeah, I forgot where he dropped down to after spinning in stole. I can't remember, buddy. I can't remember. The train of three still going after two detached. Uh, Lindo actually checked out right now. The gap is 13 seconds, so... See you D4, uh, D5, perhaps? Look at Gilchrist chasing Lorenzo for 13. Uh, right here. Gaps a little larger now than what I was seeing on the Delta, but they were tighter than that. Welcome, Justine. Death has happened. Don't worry. I think we uh, there'll be more. So looks like Lung and Cliff came in the pit together. No one, um, I guess Cliff decided to follow instead of opposite. That's an interesting strat. Um, actually, undercut. No, I, I, I. When you're fighting like that, I, I prefer overcut if. If you are the chaser, um, opposite in general, but that is an interesting choice. And Johnston chasing Godzilla of uh, Edward Ryan. Oh, mid-corner breaking from the Godzilla. That's why I lost a good bit of pace try to, to Johnston. Tame down, try to tame it down a little bit. Yeah, most likely. And oh, I forgot that oh. Stoll exit or uh, Vale exists. Free place for Johnston. Freebie, he uh, looks like he lost it on the breaking coming into that. Uh, yeah, he just forgot the... 
the corner the exists. Oh, he's giving him a flash. Oh, he did he? Go. I didn't see yeah, that. He, yeah, no, he was flashing them when they come out, so he may have left. Oh no, the I lost Darren again. Yep, so the fight are fairly spread out after the P23 pit. With this mook, we'll see uh, when uh, Darren come back alive or not, I suppose. Where is Lung? I'm looking for that man. Whoa, what happened? So Lung came out P15. Um, nothing surprised there. What's surprising is uh, Cliff is full five seconds behind Lung. What's the pit delta? Yes. It is a full four second stationary extra for Cliff and five second extra for Pit Delta. Oof, oof. So let's look at Learn real quick. Go on his relative. So right now he has a nearly 10 second relative immediately in front of him. So clean air. I think I just lost my stream again. Yes, you just died and welcome back. Like oh, Easter all over much. again. It is, it is indeed. Hi, my name is Jared. But luckily you didn't take three days. I'm glad I could join you. No respawn delay. Wow, oh, we're back in uh, Vince Nicolet. Four tens behind Casey Rich. Uh, we got, looks like we got Ryan on Johnson pretty close too. Ryan For Johnson, people. yes. A little further than this one, yes. Oh, that Porsche looks in, looking a little squirrely. Wonder how is this rear left looking? Didn't use that much of a curb, but Nicolette lift a lot more. Massive approach in the village. Delay throttle input by Nicolette. Into a high center in the back of this mook. They both have pit. Looks like that would be a smooth pass on Sculps. Very tidy. This mook didn't really fight, left him a lot of room on the outside. Very polite. Back onto Nicolet. I see. Casey Rich dipped down into the pit. And looks like so is Johnston. And so is uh, Edward Ryan. Looks like our 30 minute mark was a. Uh, yep, a, a benchmark for a lot of drivers to pit. <coughs> You're half and half. Yep, half sees. Textbook good. Hard to go wrong here. Um, we're on a uh, rib leather wood. Put the chase on Thibodeau. On Dan. Oh, taking the grassy route. Pizzotto look, looking down the inside of Mark DC. He's Clean a move current. on Abby. What is that? Because he's already pit, knowing that Pizzuto has got pace on him, or is uh... Well, That's a good, a good question because uh, Pizzuto didn't pit and a uh, DC did so a driver who hasn't pit is overtaking someone who did Is that true? Am I mixing up the order? No, I think you're no, backwards. Right. Yeah, Pizzuto is pit and DC has not That is you're correct. So P DC is still holding to P21 Pizzuto coming out of the pits with the P20 has probably got better pace. Yes, you're correct. You're correct. Thank you Casey's back off Cliff, um, and Cliff is four seconds back from Leung, which shaved down a second since they both pit. Oh, excuse me. I'm curious to see when, where did uh, the Godzilla come out? 
Where's Godzilla? I don't see Godzilla. Did I see DC? I don't see disconnect. There it is. Ian Ryan is two seconds behind Casey Rich. There it is. Look at the pit delta real quick. And both Casey Rich and Ryan got a perfect pit stop of 34 seconds. Casey Rich got one second shorter pit delta. But from the starting position, Edward Ryan has gained two position opposite to Casey Rich. Casey Rich has lost two position at the moment. Nicolette is hopping in, coming out of the pit. Comes out in P3. Is that Delta correct? Yeah, uh, yes. Two seconds behind Lone. Because yeah. P12 has not pit just yet. So long. Do we? Do, can you see a delta between long? Oh, who's the uh, leader that's pit? Who's mm. in the pits now? Uh, no one aside from Mark DC oh, and okay. uh, Machini. Okay, so Lindo is yet to pit. Thibodeau is yet to pit. Yep, uh, and then Long is our leader. Is that true? That is not true. Lindo was, is. Uh, Lindo is definitely was, still leading. Was it Lindo and Lung was P2 that we were watching? Correct. Lung was P2. So Thibodeau, when Thibodeau pit will give up the P2, Lung will slot right into P2. Lindo has a big enough delta to come back P1 as well. The delta on uh, Lindo to Lung right now. That can is you, uh, 70 seconds. That yeah, you so, cannot see that okay. on that. Okay, but, so he'll, uh, with a perfect pit, he'll still have a 35 pit yep, second so, Yep, advantage. correct. Lin Sergio Lindo is still the effective leader of the race, accounting for the pit. And Atibito just hopped into the pit. Okay, so we'll see where he comes out. Uh, so he's just doing laps chewing gum. He is. He has been doing that since race start, I believe. That man is uh, unstoppable here. We have a Leatherwood chasing GB2. Down the ins inside for Brooklyn. And GB2 lets him have it where I believe he hasn't pit yet either. So that is correct. So GB2 didn't really fight for no, it. No, it didn't put up too much of a stink, that's for sure. Although he can, but uh, I can see maybe if he's got that much pace, not much point in holding him back. Yep. But at some point, you just don't want to waste your own time. I'm uh, surprised that GB2 hasn't been inside yet. Seems like he's not in a major fight. Maybe it would also be a not a bad time to dip in for half seas. The Bong Leo just came out behind Stopper. Is Lindo still in the pit? Uh, he Lindo has not pit. Oh, okay. Well, I thought he pit in. Nope, that was a P2, which was. Thibodeau, which is now currently P12, chasing the Bonglio. Throw half a second behind Duan Bonglio. Nice little battle. Uh, Stopper coming up on uh, GB3. GB2. GB2. Yep, yep, yep. Right now we have Stopper right behind and overtaking GB2 in Woodcolt. Uh, had to make and Leo also to is looking for a place. GB2 didn't really fight for it. He's hemorrhaging time. He should uh, maybe uh, pit in and find himself some open air and get some pace back. Yep, yep, I agree. 
because he's just hemorrhaging time now to, to yep. the purple ops, right, or to uh, blue flag, so. If he's not fighting for it, or, or if he's giving out places that easily, he should just pit. Or you just ignore them and not give out place. You don't have to defend, but you also don't just yield immediately and waste your lap time. But if he's uh, yielding this hard and this politely, I would just pit. Yeah, maybe find himself some uh, clean air. And Better places, yep. Yeah, lay down some hot laps. I'm a re Ooh, nice. This is uh, Lawrence and Heisner. Big I'm gonna play that. Oh, too late. That was a uh, nice oh. switch back. L Brooklyn oh. and love you. Uh, being polite. They're still at each other. In maggots. Oh, is that a touch? I don't think so. You Can't tell. And maggots in ch chapel. Oh, that's squirrely. Heisner is gonna have this at hangar straight. Lawrence need to tuck back in. And hope he doesn't get. Who's behind Heisner? That's Warren. Side by side into Vail. Gotta live in each other enough space, and it, they did. Maybe a switch back? Yup. Heisner definitely keep, get to keep the place he knows he get an insight on the next one. It's gone again. Nick Lett right now is P3, which is quite excellent because he uh, have a self spinny spin early in the race, hit up and kind of ruined his rear. I was uh, so right back up on the podium. I got, I got booted again, buddy. Oh, Discord hates you, huh? I don't know. It's better than a swear jar. I, I don't think I've got one swear tonight, buddy. Nope, you are still scor scotch free. So. With uh, me getting booted from Discord, does that buy me any uh, any freebies? Any point you gotta ask the admin for that? Because <laughs> <laughs> I could lay down a good square sentence right now if I get to, if I get. Yeah, have you been saving up? <laughs> yeah, we'll save it for the interviews. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Like uh, pr pretty good train forming behind uh, GB2. There is. Uh, there we go. Heisen had just got GB2. And then we have S. Martin Lawrence behind and trailed by Rob Ron. GB2 is just exiting Chapel into Hangar Straight. Oh, that, that's a good-looking picture coming out of there. They, they that is, three, that is. Three wide. GB2 oh. is in the inside. This is dicey. Is he going to give them space? Oh, this plenty of spot. space for both two of them. Yep. Nice. Well played, boys. Well played. I'm still surprised that uh, that Gordon is, is still yet to pit. Oh, is he yep. bumped him? Uh, I'm unsure. Looks that way, but can't tell for oh. sure. If nothing else, uh, he's gaining racecraft. Yeah. Or maybe he's just enjoying it and just running on track, doesn't care about point. And maybe he foresee some misfortune coming, want to save up the pit for all late. And we have a uh, Dodon Leo chasing well, Tibidal. Nice little train going there. That's a good one. Looking into Stopper's rear into Brooklyn. This corner Stopper is so a little scary. white. Yeah, I know. You are on the trail for so long. And Can easily upset the balance. Is like, yeah, and after you're done that trail, that transition back to throttle is their grip. It's always that. Is their grip? Is that question is always looming there. Into Abby, a cops. Oh, he runs Stop wide. Stop really wide. Didn't get off the throttle, so he's obviously not afraid of warnings. 
Got some speed token to spend. Also really wide on chapel by stopper. Well, that well, may compromise his compromise him down hangar straight. Oh well, he's gotta run on him. He, go, he immediately goes down the inside to try to defend. Got the inside. Got the overlap. Typical got outside. Oh, side oh, by side. Oh, Maybe touchy. looking for a switch back. Not quite. You get the Very nose. well defense. He got the nose in the grass there and a little bouncy. I know. He kept his momentum though. That's a little sketchy. I'm going to hop upward with Cliff. Chasing Nicolet. Nicolet is chasing Long. <coughs> this is a... Uh, battle for the podium three cars on the screen only two of them can be on the podium oh, oh. good park on the apex and he back him right up i don't think so no i think it might have been a poke there we'll... oh gb3 got stop go 30 by serving the pit oh now i know now we know why he was waiting oof sir i'm sorry we shouldn't have talked about it, Q. We should have mentioned that man's pit. That should be a freebie for the square jar. F, Gordon. It should be a freebie for GB2 square jar. <laughs> oh, it is. Guaranteed. That is white. Oh, Ryan. I bet you right now his square jar is spilling over. Yes, that man better be saving up for that square jar for the stop code 30. <laughs> Now Edward Ryan's getting chased by Johnston. I love the sound of this car. That is really wide for the Godzilla. It's just to hang on to it. Back up on Cliff and Nicolet. Into village. Looks like Lung's a teeny bit deep. Gap to Lindo. Gap to Lindo from Lung is six and point six second. Lindo it's pit. Point. I totally even did not catch that, but yep. that man is gone. Yep. So. Yep. That was just curious. I didn't catch it either. Yep. He's been so far ahead, he really hasn't got a whole lot of uh, screen time He's tonight. so far ahead, he can dip into D3's division. He's so fast, he tra transcend himself into D3 server. <laughs> so, hey, boys. Comes out, she comes out in P2. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> hey, fa fellow D6er. <laughs> yeah. So, to check it on this. Looks like uh, GB2 is in the pit again. To serve his stop and go. I uh, hope he doesn't uh, pull a Darren. What did you do? Uh, I got a stop and go for uh, serving my stop and go. Oof. <laughs> Yo, dog, I heard you like stop go. <laughs> so I gave you a stop go 30 on your stop go 30. It's like, oh, seriously. <laughs> yeah. uh, I want to say it was Kai Lami. Uh, this season? Ooh, down oh, down the inside oh, for Nicolet. Oh, oh, Maybe oh, looking oh. at a switch back, but Nicolet got the inside for Vel. Oh, that's some crazy. Gotta hold him tight. Right you gotta hold him tight. Shove it right oh, in. Oh, oh, but oh, Lerm's oh. gotta got it inside for the second Vel. That's wow. excellent racing for these three. Oh, anything can happen here. Oh, he oh, goes oh. wide. I wonder if he spent a speed token there. That is very respectful racing. I bet both are the, of them are clinching really hard. Oh yeah, that was tight. He's still after him. Long so deep. Great racing right here, folks. Not oh. enough sw for a switchback. No, that's hard to take that that tight. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and he made it though, but may have compromised his throttle a little bit. 
making that turn that tight is going to ask you to lift on the lift extra exactly. That corner. And you're going to compromise the Wellington straight down the inside of Brooklyn. Oh, really tight for the exit. Looks like Lone's going to have a bad exit there. That definitely put Nicolette too close to Cliff. Cliff's got an inside of Woodcolt. Coming Culps. Oh, okay. Oh. Cliff Yield. Cliff Yield didn't want to die for it. Oh, so Lone's team is definitely still away. looking at a 1 2. Yep. Yeah, P4 is quite close. Three cars fighting to two, for two podium spot. Looks like we have a train off and now the three coming approaching. So if these three are, uh, are massing around, the other three cars in the back may join the battle as well. There'll be a quite a long train. And a Lindo also extended the six and a half second gap to 10 now. So no big deal. He just, yep, he's going to be in a D2 server pretty soon, or D3. Uh, I'm looking at the standings here. It looks like uh, Ryan is in... Uh, he's in position to take a silver championship tonight. He is currently leading the... Oh, oh, Nicklet! Oh, that's unsafe rejoined by Nicklet for sure. I was looking at standings and I missed what you I were... I will replay that for you. Nicklet in the middle. Went white, the rejoin definitely unsafe and took Cliff with it. Yeah, he had no control of the car coming off the grass. Oh, yeah, no. he should have stayed on the asphalt for longer on the outside. He just jammed it right in and took Cliff with him. Now Lone can take a relatively good breather, breather with a three second gaps behind, but that brings. Um, oh, look at the back real, K, real quick. Casey Rich versus uh, Scott Johnston. They brought these three cars right uh, a bit closer to a uh, cliff. Tight battle here for P5. Massive approach speed. Oh. This is too tight for Chapel. Yep, he's going to get left behind by Casey Rich. Exit. And hang a straight. Look at the wing. And Edward Ryan's on the inside oh. of Stoll. Down. Hang a straight. Clean pass. He nice compromised pass. Chapel too yep. much. Yep. Oh, oh and he oh. goes wide. Edward slide and, and cough that place. Back. Yep. Cough that place right back up. Yeah, delayed switchback. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> there must be some voodoo yeah. business here. <laughs> Wait for it. Nine minutes left to go, folks. Uh, this has been some great racing. Yeah, we have another five laps. Like I was saying, Cuba, it looks like uh, Mr. Edward Ryan could uh, could uh, could upset this silver division tonight. Yeah, um, who is currently leading after a seven uh, race in silver? Uh, uh, Mike Heisner and followed by Hashem Rimsk, uh, both of whom are well, lower. I don't even see Rimsk on track tonight. I don't see Rimsk, yes. And I must, wait, uh, Heisner, you said, is leading? Uh, Heisner is in the lead right now with 312 points. He's got a 33-point gap to uh, Edward Ryan, who's in second. Heisner, I don't know if that's enough. P6 versus P11. I don't know if it is enough to take that. Uh, let me see if I can pull up those standings. Yeah, and then uh, we have a uh, drop points. point also as well. So, but I, I agree, it is tight here. Um, but I don't know if it's enough, especially if uh, Edward Ryan keep coughing up the place he gained. So, where did we say? Uh, where did we say? P5? Uh, let's or say P5. P5. I'll give him that. Okay, so he has P5, four more laps. P5 is 80 points. Mm hmm. And P11? 
is 57 points. So remember that, 80 and 57. Okay, that's 23 points, Delta. That's not enough. No, it is not, not enough. Yet. Yep. So no, he, he needs to, to hope for a drop. Oh my lord, Casey Rich went oh. sideways. And that slight oh. tap on the bump bump. No one died. That was hard to dodge because so, yeah, but no one died, no, so that's good. Nowhere to go. Uh, that yeah. was good. That was, uh, that was skill. That was on both drivers. Yep, Casey Rich is still wiggling around. The rear is gone. I feel like it can be quite difficult for the, for Rich to defend right now with a rear it's still coming out. Yeah. So how his hope I, is to back him up to Ryan. Yeah, I can't remember how early he pit, but uh, 60 minutes or uh, 35 minutes, 40 minutes on a set of tires in the Porsche is going to be dicey on this track. That's a hard oh, squeeze. Oh. Johnston got an inside shove it right in. That was Little enough overlap, banging. I believe. That's not going to be switched back, not from Aintree. Oh, so Rich this, lost two position here. These guys are fighting hard for these positions tonight, boys and girls. Awesome racing. That what is, a race. What a race. Rich still looking down the inside. Oh. Ryan didn't leave him any space. Showing him, showing him the nose again. how wiggly rich is gonna be a little wide for baguettes better than ryan better than ryan so down hanger street ryan's gonna be under threat not quite not quite i think uh, rich will come down the inside and show the braking no he backs out yeah, I think Rich yield. And Heisner's Thibodeau into Maggots. Ooh, oh, Heisner definitely wide. Oh, oh, no, GG. Oh, That's no, it. Oh, no, oh, you no. cooked your tired. With three laps to go. That's no oh. coming back. Okay, so is this putting him down how many positions? Right now, we're still counting. He's not done losing yet, sadly. He's not done losing yet. He's still wobbling oh, everywhere. Oh. And he's gone again. Yep. Oh, and he took he, someone oh, out. Oh, and he collected. And there was a collection. That is a Pazuto, looks like. Okay. I'm, I'm laying one down. You're Shit. With this Shit, curse. Uh, dude, hold your break, my dude. That is his fault. Not not oh, holding his break. No. Yeah. Uh, Edward Ryan's looking good here. That so may be that upset Heisner right now. It's P18. Or information. So Heisner, if Heisner goes to P18, that's only 39 points. Oh, Beyblade cosplay again. Yeah, his tire is so cooked, dude. He cannot keep it straight. Oh, no. He's he needs gone to again. jack up that TC to help him. Okay, you know what? I think that may have just opened up uh, Mr. Ryan for taking a step through. It really has now... been. Yeah. Um, so, again, I'm going to send out that apology. Sorry, Heisner. I didn't mean to mention your name in that point standings. <laughs> Yo, now he's just pointing his car every way but forward yeah hoodoo voodoo the poor guy he ends up where on that points on that uh p18 or is he even farther than that he now? is uh 20 now so yeah so p p20 only lands him 33 points which gives a 47 point spread which uh 47 point spread is enough to push him yep well He's passed. also really deep in the village, 47 point. Let's see, we'll still have to look at the uh, drop race. Depends on how much, how many points each driver's dropped. But uh, uh, it is... Edward, Edward Ryan has already had his drop race. Uh -huh. so how many Heisner. points did he drip? Each drop. Uh, oh, they're gone. They're, they, so they've already been counted and the drop races are right, already gone. But if gone. this is the, the worst race, then they would drop this instead. And they would gain point. Yeah, but they don't have any points on the drop points now. So it looks like they've both already used their drop race. No, no, if this race is worse than a drop race, then this become the drop race. Oh, 
I don't know. I don't know how to. I don't know. I have no idea yeah. how to calculate that. Yeah, it, I it's tricky. It. I never thought of it like that, Q. Thank you. Um, but I do agree. Still, Ryan is looking nice here for uh, last race class win. Yeah, and so what I will say to that, Cube, is I'm not saying the man's name again during this stream. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe you need to for extra drama. <laughs> yeah, right, 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 right. right. <laughs> just like when... <laughs> yeah. Lung just coughed it up ice. I was I spaced out. I'm going to replay that. Uh, Alan Lung just lost his P2 spot to Cliff. I'm going to replay. I'm replaying that on screen. I spaced out talking. I believe this is Wellington straight into Brooklyn, correct? When really deep into Brooklyn. And just lost the spot. A lapse of focus. So Loon now currently sitting P10 gold. Okay. Okay. The final lap now. Give it all you can. Oh my god, the, that was so sketchy in the back. Oh my. Oh. And uh, uh, Hemion. Why am I not finding him on the list? How many else down there? Quite a ways. Yeah, so he Cl Cliff is in uh, P12 right now, Lung P10. Yeah, fairly sure Lung's not gonna gain any um, individual spot or, or, or significant individual spot, but I do believe the team championship is. Uh, they may be upset here. Oh, 100%. I agree 100%. Oh, Stefan Buckley is accusing you high math. I, uh, uh, I would like you to clear your name. You're so bird. This mook. Let's check out this mook real quick. This mook didn't come dead last. Well, oh, after being wrecked. Yeah, 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 he did. To my defense, Stefan, I don't do math when I'm sober, so. <laughs> Just don't do math, period. <laughs> <laughs> Let's check out our biggest winner yeah. and loser tonight so far. Actually, yeah. we were talking trash on Rob Ron's team, but Rob Ron himself is the biggest winner at the moment, gaining uh, 13 place. Second biggest winner is Dodonglio at currently P9, gaining 12th place. Biggest loser is Heisner, have a very unfortunate early on, lost 16 places. Yes. Early, early unfortunate, and then uh, with, at the very end with the tires gone, we saw him slipping and sliding. That's uh... oh, Sean saying uh, Heisner has zero drop points, so it depends on how many drop points uh, um, Edward Ryan has. This is a very close call on a silver win. Who do we interview? Yes. So that when you say yes, you mean both. All of them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just go to their chat. Yes. <coughs> um, Excuse me. We have uh, Elwood Ryan, <coughs> P, uh, our current silver leader P, in overall P5, chasing Scott Johnson, Johnston, chasing Alan Long. Alan Long definitely got dropped by uh, Cliff by a little bit. Not a little bit, three seconds. Um, this is a uh, white flex, so last lap for them. Ooh, Johnston, what happened? Johnston just caught up a place for Godzilla, Ryan. Replaying that. This should be Abby. Oh, what? Oh. Did he Weird. let him have it? Did the man ran out of fuel? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh shh. <laughs> and same for Ryan. Oh no. Ryan has no drop race either. So <laughs> this silver is looking tight, 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 tight. Oh no. This oh, is crazy. But Johnston got shaft <laughs> by himself. He didn't look at his fuel consumption. Can he, does he have time to reload a setup and get back on track and not oh, get a DNF? Question. I don't know. I don't know if that's allowed. So, yep. So, uh, I lungs P3 still on the podium. 
P4, late stage grab for uh, Edward Ryan. JC Rich fifth. Vincent Nicolette, pretty good comeback. P6, Johnston is dropping, I believe. Yeah. Yes, correct. Rip Leatherwood is P7. Not bad, sir. And with Andrew, look really slow. Oh, he has oh. fuel as well. Oh, no. <laughs> Will he make the line? Will he make the line? Oh, no. Come on. You push, push, spot. push, push, too push, push. He, he made it over the line. Oh, my goodness. Drama. Last turn. Two cars out of fuel. Last lap. My heart. Oh, shit. Not good for my blood pressure, D6. Every time when I'm with oh. you guys, my dude. That was great racing, guys. Congratulations, uh, still have D6. Car what a coming fantastic back. Fantastic season. Uh, park, us, uh, park us on the finish line and we'll call them out across the line. Yeah. And now we have Claymore coming across. And followed him. We got Heisner coming in, all banged up and dirty. Yep. Fall followed up by Thibodeau and Mark TC. And Gilchrist. We got GB2 coming in behind those lads. Oh, GB2 already crossed. Oh, he's in the pits and uh, Acorn. Yep, and then Gilchrist. Coming on. DC got DQ. What happened? Mark DC got DQ. I. I don't know. WT. I don't know. Could he get a DQ from track limits? No. No, you just get more DT. What did he do? Did he go? I don't know. Go... And also, if you if if you have a penalty you didn't serve, you just get extra time. You don't get DQ for not serving yeah. penalties. Uh, did he go backwards on track after? Did he get a DQ oh, for doing donuts? Oh, that is very possible. Celebratory donuts, and you had back too much. <laughs> Whoa. He's doing, he doing some donuts and get a DQ. I uh, hope they overlook it. I, um, I, I hope they do. Oh, is there, my. Is there any way to go into a replay at this God. point, or is that too late? Uh, we technically can. Uh, do you have the capability to grab people for uh, interview? I do not. You do not? Okay, I'll do that then. Then I will... Uh, Save the replay for later. I'll do the interview grabbing part. Who should we kidnap? I think we should talk to Rich. Or sorry, I think we should talk to Edward Ryan for sure. Sergio Lindo. Lindo. Pa I do not so, see uh, a Lindo. So, uh, uh, Edward Ryan for short. And we'll, we'll say Lung and Lindo were teammates for the uh Yes, the I'm going to grab Lung first, I guess, then. Hello, Alan. Oh. Nope, nope. He, he didn't stay long. He did not like us. All right, second time to charm Alan. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hi. Congratulations, dude. Congratulations, man. What a ride. Oh, that's an that's intense race. That was sketchy. You lost it at a Brooklyn for Cliff behind you? Yeah, it was a little too much pressure and my tires were gone by then. Um, did yeah. you check how much tire you have left by the end of the second stint? Oh, I, I didn't, I didn't check, so I'm not sure. Yeah, but it was I, less grip than the first stint. Less grip than the first stint. How was the pressure yeah. holding up? Did, is, was oh, it correct at least? I think so. Um, you think so? Yeah, I don't know. I wasn't really paying attention to that. <laughs> I am. Uh, I know my lap times were were dropping as I was uh, as further I went. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think I'm still checking. You guys may have uh, the team standing. Mm. Uh, the team win. You guys were starting tonight with uh, second place. Yeah. And the team standing. I'm still waiting for it to update, but uh, it's possible that you guys have. Team win. I think we were 48 points behind. Yes. 48 points yeah. behind. Your drop yeah. points are 64, and yeah. P1 drop points were 36. Mm -hmm. That's that's a 48 gap with yeah, uh, so a, a, a sizable amount of drop points. We're waiting for the update on... Uh, it's really tight, really tight, so... Yeah. Uh, do you talk much to your teammate? Do you know how, how did he feel coming to this race? Um, 
I think this was his best night for sure. I, I saw him a few nights uh, for practice, but then uh, he pulled it off uh, like sub two minute. He oh. just off. Yeah. Um, you were yeah. pretty good too. You had a well. You lead. You led up five car trains for half the race, if not more. Yeah. I, well, I was it sweaty? <laughs> yeah, well, it was definitely sweaty. <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, I can't believe, uh, to reduce that sweat, I, I went to pits, and then there was like two other cars that went the same, same plan. <laughs> yeah, so um, your pit was good. Your pit, well, I would say, perfect um, in that sense. Uh, luckily for you, Cliff gave you a teeny bit of time, a good couple of seconds from the pit, but sadly, at the later yeah. end of the race. Yeah, yeah. That was a good move. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, congrats for the uh, podium still. Yeah, thank podium you. still yeah. podium. Uh, it's good to hear you on uh, D6 chat. Uh, yeah. I mean, uh, uh, broadcast, yeah. Yeah, Curtis dropped out busy, so I'm feeling yeah. it. Yeah. Good to have you guys too. Yeah. I miss it here as well, to be honest. Yeah. yeah. Uh, thank you, thank you, Darren, as well eh, for the. Uh, oh, you're, you're welcome. Awesome you're season. welcome, yeah. Alan. That was, yeah. uh, it was it was great. I enjo really enjoyed commentating with you guys this season. I'm good. And I'm new, learning, and uh, you guys are all still right. Everything. We're all new. We're learning. Mm -hmm. SRA, right. the best best league in the world. Absolutely. <laughs> well, congrats. I'll send you back to a D6 chat. I am uh, eager to see when the points update for the team for you guys. Yeah, okay. I'm eager to see what happens there. I want to see a shoey, my man. Yep. <laughs> That'd be nice. All right. Yeah. Congrats. Okay. Thank you, guys. Congrats, buddy. All right. Let's look. Uh, um, I'm waiting for the update. Waiting for the update. Refresh again. Not quite. Okay. Let's grab uh, Edward. He's in there. Hello, Edward. This is the oh, okay. commentator booth. Welcome Hello. to the welcome to the booth, Edward Ryan. Well, congrats on the tonight, class buddy? win. What's up, guys? How y'all doing? Oh, awesome, man! How about How you? How are you, you doing after the class win? Oh, bro, bro, I'm 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 drenched in sweat right now. I don't even know I don't even know what I what did I finish fourth? Uh correct. In this race, anyways. Yep, P4, because P four for the race. Johnston, like I suspect, points. ran out of fuel in front of you. Yep, that's my battle buddy. He veered right, and I was like, okay, he's out of fuel. That's cool. Yeah, that was, uh, we were thinking, what, what's happening? What is happening? Um, so, yeah. yeah. As we're watching, uh, I'm calculating points between the gap and you and Heisner. And it was like, okay, you're running in P6. Heisner was running P11. It was like, uh, he right now, and Cube's doing the math. You don't have enough. You don't have enough. You gained two position, and Heisner had a, had, had a falling out in the last, at the end of his race. Which pushed you in for, uh, yeah, where you're sitting right now, man. How, how, how are you feeling about that? You may oh, have a class right win. Now? You may have, I might have a class win silver division? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, We're not 100% sure. We're just still waiting for the update, but that is a uh, very real possibility. I am grateful for a podium, much less one. That's cool, man. That's what's up. Yeah, so that would take you P3 from where you're sitting right now to uh, a, a, a series or a division win tonight. And possibly a, a season win for uh, Silver. Nice, will... that's what's up. Fully not expected. That's 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 awesome, man. I don't even know what to say. Yeah, so Heisner did not have a drop race. And did you have a drop race? You did not either. So that is looking really real right now that you outscore him. Well, that's what's up. Uh, First, I want to thank my sim rig. I want to shout out my IG at E Ryan Racing. Everybody can come and look at my nice fancy rig. <laughs> I've been doing this for roughly a year, dude, and this rig is the reason I'm as decent as I am, and I just want to keep elevating. That is a lot of money right. to drop. I can see. Yeah, it's super fun, man. It's more money than I want to talk about. Everybody on the online they always asks me how much I got in it. I'm like, man. I don't, it's it's really none of your business one and two. I just don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> there was point there, and it's not that far off. There was points where my sim rig is worth more than my car. Right. <laughs> yeah. Not I bought a new car, so that's not where we're at right now. But when we get to that point, that'd be like at the, the, the thirty grand range. But yeah, no, we're not going there. Right. Yeah. No, that's a, that's a little <laughs> much. I feel like I'm at a good stopping point with my rig. Yeah. So how long uh, have you seen any? Re are you still hitting the refresh button, Cube? I am still spamming F5, you're correct, but uh, no, we are not. But also, 
silver win is quite easy to calculate so they none of them had drop rate so 33 point gap between uh, Mr. Ryan and Mr. Heisner. Mr. Heisner, I want to say if I go back and look at uh, yeah, what the, that gives a P4 is 85 points and Heisner finished P19. Yes, is 37 points. So <laughs> are we sitting with the champion right now? Or? I we may be. We'll no, so wait for the official. 85 minus 30, 85 minus 37 with a gap needed of... Yeah, that's enough. 30, 33 points. Congratulations. Just by eh? singular points, uh, singular digit point. Um, how, was the, how were the tires at the second stin? Uh, they were good until my right rear blew out with like five laps left. How bad were they? Like the pressure... Uh, I, pressures was good. I actually put a lot of time on my setups this week. Um, nice. Yeah, I was. Right, I was. Right I, was I was twenty six six, twenty six eight on all all fronts, all tires until the blowout. Yeah. Yeah, on the practice. second set, I blew the first set just because I had a bad quality, so I wanted to make some time up. Practice and prep makes a lot of difference, doesn't it, my man? It, it most definitely does. I learned that the hard way. Like I said, um, I I, I haven't been doing this very long. That's well, good. I'm glad you're having fun here. here. Yeah, for the amount of time you've been in, you uh, dedicate SRA. We love having you. This is one of the best leagues that I've seen so far. And uh, yeah, for a year in, I think we all got to watch out in higher divisions for uh, Mr. Edward Ryan. <laughs> the Elevation King is coming. I'm coming for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hope you get out of the bottom div division soon. I'm sure yeah, you will. I hope so too. Yeah. It's, all, it's all love too, man. I, I talk a lot of smack, but it's, it's genuinely, it's all love, man. I just, I love it. I hear you, buddy. That's, uh, that's part of this part of the whole game, right? Yes, sir. Don't forget the shoey. If you win the division champion for silver, you get to drink sh beverage out of your shoe. A beverage out of my shoe? Yep. Usually, it's I'll beer. do that as soon as somebody brings me my flowers. Well, you, I'm, I'm sure the admin will tag you, so they will give you <laughs> instruction how to drink liquid out of a shoe. That's a yeah, wrong yeah. way and the right way to do it as well. I'll be me and Cube will be bringing you your flowers on horseback. That's what's up, man. Y'all get them flowers. Y'all got y'all got me chugging that beer out of an old shoe. <laughs> oh, uh, no oh, congratulations! Uh, cheers, man. Thanks for dropping by the broadcast booth tonight, man. Uh, great race, great season. All the best to you in the in the in the following. I hope you stay with us, all right, my man. Oh, I, I'm I'm in it for a long haul, man. I appreciate y'all. Thanks for broadcasting everything. Oh, thank you. I'll see you next season. I'll send you back to the. Race chat. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, who else we have? Yeah, Lindo's not here. I don't see Lindo. There's Cliff. Cliff is here. You might want to drag Let me Cliff get in. that man real quick. Oh, my, my phone's ringing. Just a sec. Yeah. Mute your mic. Hello, Cliff. Hello. Congratulations for P2. Thank you, sir. I was very surprising. <laughs> that was a uh, that was a good move. You took advantage of the mistake that Alan made. So you have been behind him for some time. Yeah, he was very, very defensive in his driving, and he was cutting off the uh, all the exits at the entrance. There's not much I could do but sit back and wait and hope for something like that. Yeah, when I uh, hop on board into the passenger side of the car, I can hear your engine, and you just get back up and back up. Uh, so many corner after corner, you could not use your throttle. No, I wanted was to stay it frustrating? Close to <laughs> As normally it would be, yeah, it was frustrating, but after that, I just kind of settled and then just went for him to make a mistake, fill his mirrors up, make him nervous. And he did. And he did. And he gave you the P2. Yeah, you could have done it 255 minutes in, but here we go. <laughs> well, well, that man took some pressure to crack, but you cracked him. Yeah, not, not only this time, though. We've been, I've raced him many, many times, and he's always right there with me and not in front of me. Oh, really? Yeah. That, that sounds fun. It's fun to have a battle buddy. It is. Where paces are very, very similar. So anytime I come across him, he's, he's quite a handful. Nice. And all the props to him to hold on for that long. Um, oh, that's right. I remember you decided to pit with him. 
not really a decision with him. <laughs> okay. Just kind of the way it happens. I okay. glanced at the clock. I was like, all right, well, this is about where my tires are going to be done. I'll I see. keep putting the pressure on. I went to Dev in the pits, and he's still in front of me. Damn. There's I see. No so you were just planning on about halfway mark anyway. Yeah. It just dumb luck it in at the same time. I see. I see. Yeah, the Delta was less than a second between them when they just both put into the pits. Oh, what happened in the pit? Because I saw you uh, you came out of the pit a, a couple of seconds before or uh, after him. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Everything seemed all right. Didn't miss seemed a shift. Right. Didn't speak. Okay. Yeah, it just seemed fine. But yeah, you just beat me out of there. Oh, dang. That's kind of unfortunate. I'm glad you caught back up. It took you some time, but you caught back up. Yeah, I managed to track him down. Yeah. <laughs> and you cracked him eventually. Um, Maris, how long have you been in SRA? I joined last June, I think it was. So what was that? Season seven? Nice, Eight? you have been enough. So a good like bit, good bit. I'm glad you're still staying with us. Oh, yeah. Um are you racing next season? Of course. Good to hear. Always good to to hear we have a returner. Um, well, congrats for your second uh, 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 P2. Uh, Darren, do you have any more questions before I send him back to the chat? No, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm all good. Uh, the Cliff, and congratulations. Thanks for staying with us at SRA. It's been a, it's been a great time uh, helping with commentary with you guys this season. Uh, all the best to you, my man. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the commentary as well. It's very amusing to hear. <laughs> good. Um, I'll send you back to race <laughs> chat. I'll see you next season. Cheers. Cheers. All right, Casey Rich, he is the gold winner. Sir Rich. Casey Rich. How's it going? What do you got, man? Oh, man. Uh, Silverstone wasn't my best performance. Those tires were uh, wearing out quicker than I was expecting, and the tail end of that car was uh, getting loose. Um, but it was a good race. It was a good you know, battle for... Second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and we were all, you know, together for like a long four. train. So it was a good, good performance with everybody out there. Um, it's a lot of fun. Like, it definitely got me sweating. So, <laughs> yeah, um, Silverstone for sixty minutes in a Porsche is sweaty when you're out there by yourself, let alone uh, in the in, in the battle zone. Yeah, I mean, uh, I haven't driven this track too much, um, so I wasn't sure what to expect on it. Um, people are saying that the tires wear out pretty quick, so I was kind of expecting that, but um, just wasn't in tune with the, uh, you know, how the car's going to kick out in some of the corners. But um, no, I was, I was able to de defend pretty well there a couple times, but um, we, you know, did some knocking around and uh, the last half of that lap, and just couldn't couldn't hold the T4. Still though, even though at P5, um, you still held the goal win for D6 overall. Is this your first class win? Yeah, this would be my my first championship. Um, I was honestly surprised. Like you know, uh, looking back, like halfway through the season, I wasn't even keeping track of points. I just figured everyone else is doing better than me. <laughs> um, this is my <laughs> second season uh, racing with SRA. Um, but yeah, I was just primarily focused on keeping it consistent and um, trying to avoid pileups and, you know, giving everybody the space that they need and trying to, you know, put myself in a, you know, the spot that I need. So, um, yeah, I was, I was surprised to, to see myself on the podium, you know, I mean, like five races out of the, the series. So, um, surprised myself, honestly. Um, do you have a shoe in mind? Uh, <laughs> Oh, a, a nice, a nice and safe, consistent shoe. Yeah. No safe. It has to be nasty as hell. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I do like my uh, my leather Pumas. You know, they look like uh, racing shoes. So maybe I'll have to go with that though. <laughs> um, I got some uh, cowboy boots too that I haven't worn in like five years. So maybe I'll pull those out of the closet. <laughs> just, just for a good, good time. Drop, drop the cobs out of them and the webs. Yep, yep. You no, know, you gotta skip them, them in for extra flavor. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I'll probably, probably do the Puma, you know, it's, uh, it's my style. It's in days, theme. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, congratulations for the win. Um, is there anyone or anything you want to th thank or shout out to before we send you back to the race chat? 
Uh, no, I mean, just want to thank my friends for really getting me into it. Um, I used to be really into racing when I was younger, but, you know, this is my, you know, first time owning a, a sim rig and, you know, kind of getting into it this year. Um, so glad that my friend sort of pushed me into it while they were getting into it. So are your friend in SRA? Uh, they haven't joined me. Uh, they told me about the series. Um, I'm trying to get them to, to join me for the Definitely. 24 hour race. So, uh -huh. um, but oh, really? yeah, they, they a multi-class, uh, multi-class is also low commitment. Definitely. Yeah. We did, we did like one or two multi-classes together, but, um, sometimes they, nice. you know, have a you know busy schedule, but, yeah. um, but yeah, they, they really got me into it and, um, it's been a lot of fun this year. So um, well, I hope to see you next season as well. Definitely. This Porsche was, uh, was a lot of fun to learn, so. <laughs> All right, well, congrats I, I, on the I, I, gold win. Yeah, Thank you I'm so trying, much. I'm trying to learn it now. We'll see what happens, man. Uh, we'll watch your laps a bit, and we'll uh, see if I can get any tips. For sure, yeah. Let me know. <laughs> um, <laughs> but, yeah, thank you guys for commentating every week. I'm sure it's a, you know, big-time commitment, and uh, it really makes the, you know, the racing much more, more fun, knowing that, you know, people are watching and um, talking about it and, you know. That little bit of extra immersion. It's just an added part. Uh, I I really enjoyed it when I go back and look at one of my races and it's been commentated and I saw you guys weren't getting commentated this season. It was like, I'm going to volunteer. I don't know if I'll be good at it. doesn't matter. We'll get you guys on a stream so Grandma can come back and see uh, you know, <laughs> your, your, your name on the screen. It's like, hey, look, my boy's on. Hell yeah. <laughs> right? so that, that's of what course, that's all yeah. about, right? So. One lump in them little clips everywhere. Look at this pass I made. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cheers, my man. Yeah, thank you guys. All right, congrats. I'll see you next season. Yep, see you next season. Cheers, man. Cheers. All right, looks like that's all we have. They uh, have dismissed the race chat. What a wrap for D6. Two that lead was, change uh, in silver and the team championship in the last race. That was, uh, that was a crazy mix-up. That is. Yeah. And to interview with someone that doesn't know yet that they've won. It was like, what? I know. Yep. Uh, like, the, the race um, uh, uh, standing just updated. I'm checking simracingalliance.com. And it is. We, are, we did not mess up the math. Uh, Edward Ryan did win. And Leung and uh, Sergio's Lindo's team also did upset. What a race for the wrap to wrap the season. Uh, TC8. Uh, yeah. The GTRT, the generically themed racing team, OBDA, coming P2. CDR yep. boys in P3 for uh, Black for Flight season. Racing. Yep. Yeah, Casey Rich, Sergio Lindo, and Vincent Nicolet, P1, 2, and 3 for overall. So... Let's wrap up the race for uh, season season ten for SRA main series for Division Six. Hopefully, you will the chat will join us next season. Don't forget to like and subscribe our channel. Uh, be aware of when our stream comes out. Yeah, thanks, Jess. Um, yeah, like and subscribe. Talk with us on the chat. We always look at the comment when we're racing as well. So, any last word, Darren? Uh, hey, great season. That was a great season, D6. I, uh, I hope I get to help uh, with some of the commentaries next season, and we'll see you all around soon, boys. Stay with us. S season 11 to come. See y'all. Cheers, boys.